All right, players are hilarious. We got, we got Chris on the mic, guys. Miss Chris Bliss, if you haven't heard. I don't Ooh, know. What, I don't even know this game at all. So this at all. So it looks like Sun Two is a uh, port two, if I'm not mistaken. Just make sure. Uh, yeah, you're good to go. Thank you. That makes it easier. <laughs> So Sun 2 coming out as Red Falco, because we got Falco Dittas. Uh, going to Yoshi's story, game one. They this look the same to me. Are they the same guy? They're the same guy, yeah. <laughs> this one has a red jacket. He's fancy. Mm, he is fancy. That doesn't look right, though. The other I feel guy like got his, he just got his jacket on clearance. He didn't, he didn't really yeah. have a choice in the matter. He's like, yeah, white's yeah. fine. He's colorblind, Ooh! maybe. He didn't know. And that Phantasm Spike hitbox, and he's trying so hard for these edge guards. There it is. Okay. That was a really intense uh, session. Whoa, who are those right other guys? There. Shy guys? If yeah, you hit, if you uh, what are they doing? if you hit them, they extend your hitboxes, but oh. they could also ruin you accidentally, which is not fun when that happens. How do you tell if they're oh, part of the a background? Forward air. They look like they're part of the background to me. Oh, we tried for a wall jump dare. Nah, they're the only thing on this map that's not part of the background. There's the the elephant in the back and the DDD float spot. Mm. Or no, that's a uh, Dreamland the DDD float spot. This looks like evil twins fighting each other. Yeah. The ditto. It's like it's like Ooh, an analogy or like a metaphor for fighting. You know, when you're standing in your own way, that's what it looks like to me. They've only played on like a quarter of this map so far, <laughs> in this match. Yeah, they've only been like right over they've there. Been all to the right, trying to trying to edge oh, guard each out. other. Those oh, there's guys, a dare. Oh, no. Okay, and he landed on the platform. That was impressive. I thought he was gonna have to drop a little lower and then up B. So it's Sun Two. So fast paced. Trying to get a four stock out of Zen advanced right now, but we can see how successful he is. I think after this game, uh, Zen Advance is probably going to switch it up to Fox. I would, uh, I would hope so at least. <laughs> Considering he's got a little better matches. Oh no! So Zen Advance denies him the uh, the four stock. Let's see if he can deny him the JV right here. He's getting a lot of dare damage right now. Can I shine to dare. Ooh. Ooh. Zen Advance. Gives up that game. That was actually a JV. Somebody paused by accident because uh, I think he tried to pause reset and then realized that he lived. So, Sun 2 taking game 1 over advanced. So, how do you know who's who? Uh, do they I'll make it easy for you. Zen Advanced has the Neo tag on. Okay. So, the guy with Neo over his Got head. Got it. Zen Advanced. Ah, so okay, 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 okay. He so he's wearing. Did end up switching oh, he's to Fox, Fox now, okay. and he counterpicked FD. This is a very good counterpick from him. He can get a lot of uh, chain grabs and silly Fox things going off this map. You can get wave shines all across the map too. Go for those nice, uh, nice shine spikes as well when he's under the map. But it looks like Sun Two's not even giving him an opportunity to get started. He just keeps, uh, keeps getting him in these combos. He's winning most of the trades here. Nice back air. That's going to take the first stock. I like the rain boots. Fox has got rain boots on, it looks like. Boots. He's ready for if he picks the uh, he's ready for bad weather. If he picks the pink <laughs> skin, he's got pink boots. Oh man, it's really? great. Yeah. It's like Hello Kitty They're Fox. They're fantastic. Oh, another back air. Oh, he dared wow. for that edge guard. That was impressive. I didn't think he would notice that in time, but wow. That was that was some good melee right there. Got to give him that. So, it's an advance trying to get it started with his fox play here. Um, oh, nice up smash. Not gonna quite take a stock, but I feel like Zen Advance is insanely good at playing on the map, and Sun Two is just kind of beating him out in the edge guard game. Oh, those nice lasers to uh, make him flinch off that recovery. Lasers. Lasers. They're like, like pew, pew pew pew. Oh, like and he gets the, the edge guard. Zen Advance gets a nice F smash and takes a stock. Just three more left. Zen Advanced. Three more. Try for those dare combos again. Keeps going ham. It's like oh, so here come fast. the here come the chain grabs. This is called it in the beginning, but it's gonna build some good damage for uh, for Zen Advance. He needs that damage on Sun Two if he wants to try and make this happen. Ooh, and a nice back air. Wow. That's gonna end game two in Sun Two's favor. Game two, Sun Two, you know. So game three, we're going right back to Yoshi's story uh, with Fox instead this time. So this is a little bit of a repeat of game one, just with Fox as Zen advanced. Fox and rain boots. Yeah, silly rain boots. You know he has a uh, fake legs. Doesn't real legs. Oh. Like metal legs. He's got like bionic legs. Yep. There's a 
I like it. There's this whole story behind that. And That's really why cool. Why it's actually not a theory and is true for some reason. I forget huh. exactly, but... Well, goes for the shine and sweet spots, but uh, Sun 2 knew it was coming, so he just he just safely got back on the map. Ooh, nice grab to Bear. That's going to take the first stock in Sun 2's favor. So on this map, I think uh, I think Zen Advance is going to keep going for those, those shine spikes. They're going to be really beneficial for him. Okay, there we go. He evened it up. He's got a 22% on him, but this is definitely doable. There's a... Uh, I've seen crazier things happen in melee, I'd for sure. Oh, the up air string, the back air. Oh, but he illusions off the map, unfortunately. Even Sun 2 did, like, didn't like that. He just shooks his head, shakes his head. Oh, nice up to grab ledge. Oh, he goes for the dare, but uh, couldn't quite get it because he was already in his illusion. Ooh, that down tilt was a little, a little bit not, not his best moment right there. Ooh, the slow get up. That is the easiest get up to punish. And Sun 2 taking full advantage of that, so. We got Zen Advance on his uh, winner's bracket stock right now. If he loses this, he is out of winners and into losers. Every time one of them gets in the bubble, it makes me think of Wizard of Oz and Glinda floats in, in the bubble. He's gonna float back. <laughs> yeah. They call it the magnifying glass. I never understood that. Oh. I guess because they yeah, look smaller I see it, in but it. It doesn't really look. Oh. Because like when they're, you see when they're off yeah, the stage, yeah, really yeah, tiny. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see that. I see what that looks like in magnifying glass. Oh, and that glass, back air. Yeah. Taking game three for Sun Two. He's talking to him right now. He's saying, "I know you're better than that." That's that was just an unfortunate uh, sandbaggy game. Sandbaggy. Yeah. Oh. When somebody sandbags, it means they're like they're losing on purpose, basically. I see. Yep, Sun 2. No, it's Sun 2. 2. He didn't, not Sun 1. Different guy. But he did win. Different guy, totally. Get it? To the 